So for today, I will be making Spanish rice. We will need a piece of onion, about that much. Some white rice, long grain. A small can of tomato sauce. Bouillon, kippy chicken or tomato. And some oil. Put some oil like that much and roll it. Next, we do rice. And for the rice, you want to keep moving it. Cover it with the oil. And don't let it sit there for too long because it will burn. You just want it toasty. Now we can incorporate the onion. I personally don't like to um, bite into the onion in my rice, so I just use it like big chunks for flavor. I can easily um, find it and take it out later. I just like in a small soap It's already looking more gold and it also feels different the way it falls it just, um like harder. I don't know how to explain it but looks different, smells different, feels different, and it feels so good. about done, I'm going to lower the heat. The heat's stirring because the heat doesn't flow instantly. Or it's still hot in there. So. so frigging, even though my heat is low. So 
now I'm going to add one cup of water. And here, just to make sure I had enough, I poured the tomato sauce in here. It was like three-fourths of it. And so I put water in here, rinsed it out, threw it in here, and now it's another cup. And some people use two cups of water and one whole can. And if you want it more like wet, wetter texture which also tastes really good you can do that so one can two cups water um today i'm just feeling like i want it a little bit more on the dry side to mix mix turn up the heat all the way high and get it to boil Now we have chicken bouillon here, using a small teaspoon. I'm going to use one and like a flat one, like half, one and a half teaspoons. Now, the bouillon, it all depends to your liking. If you like it more sal um, salty or flavorful, you can add more. a pinch more really good mm. and that was it now to enjoy